Bronny James, son of LeBron James, is stable after cardiac arrest. Bronny, a basketball recruit at the University of Southern California, was stricken during a practice on Monday. He is out of intensive care and in stable condition, his family said. Bronny James played high school basketball at Sierra Canyon School in Los Angeles. LeBron James Jr., the son of the NBA star LeBron James, suffered a cardiac arrest while practicing at the University of Southern California in Los Angeles on Monday and was taken to the hospital for treatment in the intensive care unit, according to a statement from a spokesman for LeBron James and his wife, Savannah. The younger James, known as Bronny, is now in stable condition and no longer in the ICU, the statement said. LeBron and Savannah wish to publicly send their deepest thanks and appreciation to the USC medical and athletic staff for their incredible work and dedication to the safety of their athletes, the statement said. The Los Angeles Fire Department responded to a call for medical aid at 9.26 a.m. in the 3400 block of Figueroa Street in Los Angeles, the address of the university's Galen Center athletic facility, a department spokeswoman said on Tuesday. The department would not disclose who needed medical aid, citing federal policy. Ronnie James, 18, will be a freshman at USC this fall. He is the eldest of the Lakers star, LeBron James's three children. Ronnie James was a four-star recruit and chose USC over Oregon and Ohio State. The USC men's basketball program was scheduled to take a 10-day exhibition trip to Greece and Croatia beginning August 5, according to a statement it released in May. It was not clear whether the team would still make the trip or whether James would go. Cardiac arrest, when the heart stops, is different from a heart attack, which happens when blood flow in an artery feeding the heart is blocked. More than 300,000 people a year experience cardiac arrest outside of hospitals. The survival rate for those who suffer cardiac arrest and receive bystander cardiopulmonary resuscitation is just 11.2%. For those who receive immediate defibrillation, survival rises to 41%. It was not known what treatment James received. Brain damage is likely if a person in cardiac arrest goes four to six minutes without CPR, and brain death occurs after 10 minutes. Only 8% of cardiac arrest survivors emerge with a good neurological outcome. Most have some degree of brain injury, Monica Sales, a spokeswoman for the American Heart Association, said in an interview in January. USC has experience handling cardiac emergencies. During a workout at the Galen Center last summer, the incoming freshman Vincent Iwachukwu suffered a cardiac arrest and was hospitalized. Iwachukwu returned to play in 14 games for the Trojans last season. Keonti Johnson, a budding star at Florida, went into cardiac arrest during a game in 2020. He eventually recovered and resumed his career at Kansas State where he starred last season on a team that reached the round of eight in the NCAA tournament. Johnson was selected by Oklahoma City in the second round of the NBA draft in June. Few cardiac events have played out more publicly than Dammer Hamlin's collapse from cardiac arrest during a nationally televised football game last season. Hamlin, who is now attempting to resume his career with the Buffalo Bills, posted a message of support for James on Twitter. Prayers to Bronny and the James family as well. Here for you guys just like you have been for me my entire process. Montres Wright, the mother of Kijani Wright, a freshman forward with the Trojans, said that she had not spoken with her son since James's collapse, but that she hoped that he and the other members of the team were coping in the wake of the second such incident in just over a year. The concern doesn't go away when you witness something like that, she said. These kids put themselves through so much, they don't rest enough, and it's been hot. Researchers at the University of Washington have conducted an exhaustive analysis of cardiac deaths in NCAA sports. Dr. Kimberly Harmon, the lead author who is affiliated with Washington Center for Sports Cardiology, said that black male college basketball players have a higher risk of sudden cardiac death than other groups of players. The annual risk of sudden cardiac death in black division I basketball players is 1 in 5,000. 
In white players, it is 1 in 16,000. Dr. Harmon said she and her colleagues had not found an explanation for the discrepancy. We see it again and again, not only in NCAA players, but also in high school athletes, she said. James is not the only son of an NBA star who has experienced heart issues. Sharif O'Neal, one of Shaquille O'Neal's sons and a friend of James, had open heart surgery in 2018, when he was 18 after being diagnosed with a congenital heart defect that affected the coronary artery. Since then, O'Neal has documented his recovery on social media as he has worked to return to playing basketball. O'Neal had to learn how to walk again, and he spent several months in rehabilitation, according to the American Heart Association. In an interview on the Now for Later podcast this week, O'Neal said that, in 20 years, I just want to be known as that kid who fought back from something that was life-changing and made his dreams come true. I honestly thought I wasn't going to play basketball ever again, O'Neal said. Basketball is often an afterthought on the USC campus, where football reigns supreme. But that was expected to change this season, in part because of the presence of the younger James, who has 7.5 million followers on Instagram, and who would be playing home games within walking distance of the arena where his father stars for the Lakers. Crowds were expected to follow James, just as they had since the summer before he entered high school, when fans were turned away at the door of a gym at a premier high school recruiting showcase to watch him play against others in his age group. As he grew and his game developed, James came to be viewed by college coaches as a complimentary player with a high basketball IQ. A guard who was viewed as a contributor, but not a star on a team with final four ambitions. His recruitment though, largely played out as don't call us, we'll call you. And he eventually took visits, the not to basketball powers like Duke and Kentucky. Instead, he toured schools where he might play more readily, Oregon, whose benefactor is Phil Knight, a founder of Nike, the shoe company that has a strong relationship with the elder James. Ohio State, the school LeBron said he would have attended if he had been required to go to college before going to the NBA, and his close-to-home school, USC. After this season, Bronny James would be eligible for the NBA draft. LeBron James has often said he would like to play on an NBA team with his son, and he has even hinted that he wants to play with his younger son, Bryce, 16, who attends Campbell Hall School in Los Angeles. LeBron and Savannah James's daughter, Jury, is 8. LeBron James, 38, led the Lakers to the Western Conference Finals last season, which was his 20th in the NBA. In February, he became the NBA's all-time leading scorer, passing Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, who had held the title for nearly 39 years.